today we will learn different list methods in python okay so these are some methods which we will be seeing so first of all in my spider id i am writing i am declaring a list list 1 which is 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 and we will start with this append what it does is it add an element to the end of the list so the syntax is list one dot append and i need to write the element here so if suppose i want to add india here okay now i will print the list so print print list one okay i hit the run button now we can see that the india is added to the last of the list one okay now we will move to the next one which is extend what it does is it add all elements of a list to another list for that i need to add another list list 2 suppose which is 5 comma 6 comma 7 comma 8 now i want to extend the list 2 with the list 1 so i will write list 2 dot extend list 1 and i will print list 2 if i do that so see we can see that uh, here we have the list 2 first and after that the list 1 is added now let's move to the next one which is the insert method what it does is it insert an element at defined index so let's see the syntax okay so i need one list here list 1 and then i will write list one dot is it dot no, is it dot, no, dot dot insert and i first i need to write the index where i want to add the element suppose that is zero in my case and the uh, element i want to add is youtube if i do that and now i need to sorry i need to write print the list one print list one and if i hit the run button you can see that the youtube is added at the zero index okay now let's let's move to the next one which is remove so it, what it does it uh, removes an item from the list okay so let's see the syntax how it is okay so if i write list one dot remove and here i need to write the element that i want to remove suppose i want to remove the 2 so it will remove the 2 and we have left 1 3 and 4 and the 2 is gone now let's move to the next one which is pop okay so what it does it removes and return an element at the given index so let's see the syntax first of all okay so first of all i need to declare a variable suppose i am adding remove number equal to list one dot pop and here i need to write the index number which is suppose zero and then i am printing the list at first and after that i am printing the remove number variable okay now if i hit the run button we can see that one is removed from the list because i have added uh, i have entered zero index and zero one was in the zero index and here is printed one so uh, the element which i removed is added to the remove number variable the value is added in the remove number variable and because of that when we print the remove number the one is printed okay so now let's move to the next one which is clear what it does it uh, removes all the items from a list okay so so let's see the syntax we need to write list one dot clear now if i try to print the list it will what let's see what it will show okay let's see here it is showing a empty list 
what happened there it uh, th this method cleared method uh, removed all the elements inside the list one okay now let's move to the next one which is uh, index what it does it returns the index of the first matched item okay so i am just modifying the list here comma 5 comma 7 comma 2 comma 3 comma 1 okay now if i write here i need first of all i need to declare another variable which is suppose i am declaring the index is equal to list one dot index suppose what i will write i will write uh, three okay now if i print the index you can see that it says two because the there are how, how many three are in there first three second three so the first three is zero one two in the two index so it returns two okay now let's move to the next one which is uh, count count method what it does it it returns the numbers of items passed as an argument okay so let's see an example so in the list one if i write count is equal to list one dot count and suppose what i want to count i want to count the number of three three so it will be dot okay now if i print the count it will give me the two because there are two numbers of three one three the first three and the second three there are two three in the list okay so it returned me two now let's move to the next one which is uh, sort okay what it does it, it sort items in a list in ascending order okay so let's see the syntax uh, i need to write list one dot sort okay in inside the braces i will inside the bracket i will write i will write nothing sort and then i will print the list okay so if i do this you can see that the list is uh, the list is sorted in ascending order 1 1 2 2 3 3 4 5 7 now if i want to uh, reorder it in descending format then i need to write reverse equal to false if i do this sorry i need to write reverse equal to true if i do this you can see that now our list is reordered in descending order okay so let's move to the next one which is reverse okay so what it does it reverses the order of list items suppose here i have this list and i write here <coughs> list one dot reverse and then I print the list and I will print ok so it ok now you can see that the whole order of the list is uh, rotated first of all let us uh, make me a clean simple list 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 now it is easily understandable ok at first it was 1 2 3 4 and now it is 4 3 2 1 okay now let's move to the next one which is copy what it does it returns a copy of the list okay so to do that i need to write here list 2 equal to list 1 dot copy and after that i am printing the list 2 if i do this and what happened here ok i missed it uh, dot copy now if i run this you can see that the list 1 is copied into list 2 and when i print the list 2 it shows us 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 which is as same as the list 1 ok so these are some 
list methods in python okay you can do your own experiment uh, using this that's all for the video thank you for watching